We're on the cusp of a colossal occasion. A semi-final encounter here at the Euros. And the nerves must surely be jangling. Who will come out on top? Stay with us on EA TV. Hello and welcome to our coverage of the semi-final here at the Euros. My name is Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry and sitting next to me with microphone in hand is Stuart Robson. Excitement levels are off the charts, it must be said. It's Germany against Denmark. Well, what a matchup between these two excellent teams. Both have played really well to reach this stage of the tournament, but which one is going to go through to the final? I think this could be really close today. Here's the starting lineup for Germany. Manuel Neuer gets the nod in goal. Antonio Rudiger plays alongside Jonathan Tarr in central defence. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. Oh, big opportunity! Oh, that was a chance to give them an early advantage. Well, they should be off to a flyer here. And that was a poor effort. He must hit the target. Foul there, free kick awarded. Well, as you can see, he gets there first, he makes good contact with the ball and finds the back of the net. That's a decent header. And once again, Germany get the ball rolling. How will they react to this setback? Joshua Kimmich, really good strong tackle, and it'll be a throw-in. Commitment to passing and attacking, Gundogan, and that is offside. Tony Kroos, Gundogan, and Kimmich, Jamal Musiala. Decent position for Germany to be in. Well, didn't go to plan in the end. Tony Kroos. Trying to open them up. Oh, a smart stop. Course with the corner. Oh, just the kind of save every goalkeeper would expect to make. Hoybier. Here's Nurgard. Slipshod passing. Oh, that's.
That's a fine looking pass. And a goal! How about that? As they increase their advantage. And who's to say they won't be going to the final at this rate? Well, let's take another look. And wow, how cleanly does he hit that? The keeper was never going to save it. What a good goal that is. And the ball is moving again. 2-0 is how it stands. And on the back of that particular challenge, will the referee let the matter rest there? Well, the card is out, and it's yellow. Yeah, it's clumsy, and it's late. Definitely a yellow card. Musiala. Trying his luck. Not out of the woods yet. And slipped through beautifully. Havertz! Vigorous defending. And Denmark come away with it. Tony Kroos. It's with Gundogan. Could be dangerous. And he's outdone himself. Wonderful save there. Fired over by Kroos. And there it is! Still life left in this game. And they have the momentum now. Well, here you can see it again. It's a superb cross, just asking for someone to go and meet it. And what a header it is from Havertz. He just knows how to get on the end of crosses. It's a very good goal. So Germany just one behind now. And who's to say the momentum isn't with them at this stage? Germany pushing forward with options available. Can he get them level? Stopped a certain goal. This might be ideal for the counter. Can they use their pace? And they'll regard that as a very disappointing end to the move. Tony Kroos. Gundogan. Well, they're moving the ball neatly enough. Just looking for that decisive pass. Crossing opportunity. And nicely struck. Well, he had a lot of ground to cover. Splendid save. Well, the corner to Germany. What can they do with this one? And played short. There's a cut back. Goalkeeping. Christensen on the ball, Yannick Vestergaard. Here's Nurgard. 
Well timed tackle. Kai Havertz. Tony Kroos. And a close offside decision as they were threatening. Free kick awarded by the referee. Well, the electronic board lets the fans know. Three minutes of stoppage time. Christian Nurgard. He read it well. Havertz. And he quartered the attack with a masterful tackle. And the whistle is sounded for half time in this game. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. Germany in a position of menace. And Kai Havertz. Surely the equaliser. Well, as you can see, they finish this really easily. They don't give the keeper a chance, do they? That's a good goal. So the ball is running again at 2 all. Jonas Vint. Really tidy looking attack, continued by Eriksson, but really sticking to the task defensively. Tony Kors. Gundogan. Kimi. That's a good looking ball. And a tidy challenge. Can they forge ahead? Well, they would have done had it not been for the keeper. Well, they should be ahead now. Yes, it was a good save, Derek, but he should score from there. Well, they've decided to make a change. And over it comes. Not away completely. And problem solved for now. Mele. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Gundogan. And it'll be a throw for Denmark. Of challenge. Joshua Kimmich. And it's a quality pass. Course. And a goal! How important could that be in the story of this semi final? Wild celebrations.
Well, here it is again. He hits this so sweetly, doesn't he? That's a brilliant goal from a top-class player. On with the game then, 3-2, what will happen next? And players waiting in the centre. Rebier, and Kimmich puts his body on the line. And that's very good refereeing to let the play flow. Jonas Vint. Is it going to be Christian Eriksen? Gundogan. Wirtz. Well, it did look promising, but no threat in the end. Nice looking pass. Well, the flag has gone up here. Offside it is. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. Havertz. This is Kroos. Jamal Musiala. Gundogan got in the way of it. Error from the keeper. Will they seize on it? Tony Kroos. Well, beating his opponent. Gundogan. And now Havertz. Well, he could have put it away again, but credit to the goalkeeper. Well, the way he's playing, he's surely going to get his second goal soon here. Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up, and now both will rely on their respective benches. Who's going to get on the end of it? Well, it has come to nothing. Gundogan, now Kimi. it has to be, great defending here, they'll be disappointed with the way that attack ended, Wirtz, it's with Gundogan. Now we're inside the final 10 minutes in this one. Just the challenge that was required. Great ball over the top. Can't miss, surely. Stopped a certain goal. And you need your defender to take charge. Can they fashion something? They need a goal. What a brilliant pass. Able to deal with the threat. Now breaking at pace. Potential danger. Can they use their pace? Kai Havertz. The fans want to see a shot. Can they slot it home? And the attack fizzling out. Hoylund. Morten Hulman. Well, they have the ball once more. Havertz. Musiala. This is Kroos. Takes the shot. And they're still in with a shout. Thanks to the keeper just then. And that's a really important save. But can they get back into this match? I'm not sure they can. They favoured a short one here. Jamal Musiala.
Joshua Kimmich. On the ball, Rüdiger. And there it is, the full-time whistle. The host nation have done it. Germany through to the final of the Euros. Well, they are in the final, and deservedly so. But that was tight in the end. They played some lovely attacking football, but at times they looked vulnerable to the counter-attack. And they will need to improve that in the final. Well, a high-level contribution from Kai Havertz. Stuart, sum up for us what most impressed you about his performance. Well, he scored one and could have had a lot more. But if you keep getting into the right areas, the goals will come. I thought he was very good today.